All right, check this shit out, guys. Two quick announcements. Number one is I did change the name of this channel to Wild California. I'm trying to reflect more of what I'm trying to do here of showcasing the wild food and adventures and nature of California. The content will be basically the same, but I just wanted to give it some branding. Second thing I want to tell you guys is that I was going to stop doing this series of rare fruits, but I found something so exciting. This is a purple custard apple. It's a relative of the Cherimoya and Atamoya. I believe actually the Atamoya is a cross between this fruit and a Cherimoya. This one is going to have a purple pink flesh. Really excited to try it. Okay, so here's this fruit. It's super purple. We're gonna cut into it now. Oh, look at that. That's gorgeous. Look at that. Beautiful fruit. All right, so here's our fruit. And they all kind of have this central stem. It's kind of a cool little feature. I'm gonna just take that out. It smells, it smells kind of like a pumpkin with a little bit of a sour hint to it, like maybe like a pumpkin cross with an orange. So let's give this a try. Oh my God, that is fantastic. It tastes kind of like red berries, like maybe strawberry and raspberry. Really, really sweet, not much tartness almost like a strawberry flavored candy, like maybe a strawberry starburst. This is, this is fantastic. It has some seeds, but they're really quite small compared to like a cherimoya and hard to get the flesh off them. This fruit is fantastic. This is one of the best things I've ever eaten actually. I feel like, you know, this is a dividing line in my life where my life up till now has been mere prelude. This, this fruit is so good. All right, well, that's my first time trying a custard apple. Have you guys tried this? This is a really rare fruit. I, I think this grows in San Diego. I'm going to save the seeds. I'm going to try to grow it. So check back in like seven years and we'll see if we have some fruit. Not sure. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll catch you on the next one.